Cloud computing is the process of using a network of remote servers hosted on the internet to store, manage, and process data, rather than a local server or a personal computer. A cloud service is any service available on demand via the internet from a cloud computing server instead of from a company's on-premise server. The CEO of Microsoft explained, In the past, there was hardware, software, and platforms, on top of which there were applications. Now they're getting conflated. That is all going to get disrupted by the move to the cloud. An example of cloud computing is an online email account. We log into an email account remotely through the browser storage, but your account doesn't exist on the computer. It lives in the email provider's cloud. The main use for cloud is sharing and storing data. Cloud storage enables users to access and download data on any chosen device, such as a laptop, tablet, or smartphone. Cloud storage users can also edit documents simultaneously with other users, making it easier to work away from the office. According to Gartner analyst Daryl Plummer, business leaders everywhere are bypassing IT departments to get applications from the cloud and paying for them like they would a magazine subscription. Let's dive into the different cloud services. The public cloud is owned and operated by a third-party cloud service provider that anyone can utilize. The private cloud is exclusively built and used for one business or organization. The hybrid cloud uses a combination of at least one private and one public cloud and can be on-premise or virtual. Now let's talk about the different types of deployment services. Based on a deployment model, we can classify cloud as infrastructure as a service, platform as a service, or software as a service. Infrastructure as a service provides hardware capacities as needed by users to run their own software services. Examples of infrastructure as a service companies are Amazon, Rackspace, and Flexiscale. Platform as a service allows third parties to build apps without buying hardware or maintaining software. Examples of a platform as a service companies are AWS Elastic Beanstalk, Google App Engine, and OpenShift. Software as a service enables users to use an application without installing it on a computer or other device. Examples of software as a service companies are ServiceNow, Dropbox, and Salesforce. A former federal CIO of the United States said that cloud computing is often far more secure than traditional computing because companies like Google and Amazon can attract and retain cybersecurity personnel of a higher quality than many government agencies. There are many benefits to switching to the cloud. You can reduce costs increase speeds, increase productivity, and increase global scale. There are many uses of cloud computing, including creating new apps and services, test and build applications, store backup and recover data, analyze data, embed intelligence, and deliver software on demand. Companies are switching to the cloud for the flexibility it brings. You can reduce the number of workstations in your office and allow employees to work from home. Cloud computing enables you to monitor business operations effectively. 
you just need a fast internet connection to get real-time updates of all operations. Let's take a look at how cloud solutions are transforming the healthcare industry. Healthcare businesses are adopting cloud computing solutions to make services more convenient and cost-effective. Healthcare professionals can access and track patient data remotely on any device in the form of electronic medical records stored on the cloud. A successful cloud implementation can improve services for patients, simplify data management, increase operational efficiency, and streamline costs. Thank you for watching. For more information on cloud technology, visit vsoftconsulting.com/cloud.